Hi all, the deer. Well, we're looking at another beast. And it basically ties in with me hog for you, dear, because the deer were going with the Addy that was made to go with it, and it is Vapor's Clouds Valhalla 38mm RDA. And yeah, it's a beast and it hits. Anyway, before we go down and check this bad boy out, um, just remember, if you like what you see, hit that like button. If you don't like what you see, hit the thumbs down button. Even better again, if you want to see more videos, more content, just hit that subscribe button. Much appreciated. So, without further ado, let's get down and have a look at this bad boy, yeah? See you in a bit. Right boys and girls, here we are at the table looking at this Valhalla. On the top you've got that nice badge there. That colour there indicates that I've got the gold one. On the bottom you've got Vapor's Cloud. On the side you've got the Valhalla badge. Got some specifications there, I mean, you know, 38mm diameter. Two wide boy chuff cap, wide boy, wide bore chuff caps, 80 airflow channels, four individual post holes, and a 12 millimeter juice well. Ah, and then you have a bit of, oh, what the hell, it looks like the foreign right, vapors cloud, all that shit. So, pop the top off. There's your, your, your Addy. But inside the box, you get. Bear with me here, you get your normal box of spares. Here we have some grub screws, a screwdriver and some O-rings. You have a spare drip tip. This one's the, sh I think there's a short one and there's a, a taller one, which I'll show you in a, I'll, I'll give me as well get it off and I'll show you. There you go. You have a tall one and a short one. Um, ball sizes. Away. Maybe that short one slightly bigger, not sure. By the way, I'm holding it. Could be slightly bigger. But I like to use the tall one, so I'll put that one back on there for now. And then you get your instruction manual, which is your vapors cloud. You know, your general use and stuff like that. Basic warnings and Destructions. That one's a good one, like, isn't it? Number 17. Do not use any Vapor's Cloud product or device in any sexual manner. Hmm. I'd like to stick that in one of my orifices. Anyway, put that all aside. And then we'll have a look at this fella. This is the Valhalla. That engraving is just absolutely awesome. There's your air holes on the side, air holes on the other side. And there's some shite in there. On the bottom, you have your vapors cloud. And here you have fight for honor and glory, live forever in Valhalla. Hmm. 510 copper pin. Sticking out quite nice, so it should be hybrid friendly. Two screws there for your earth clamp, uh, your earth posts inside. Yeah, nice looking tank, nice looking tank, nice looking atty. Like this groove in the top. Take your top cap off, so you do have an O-ring inside. Only thing is, these drip tips are propriety to this um to this atty, so. If I can get this top pulled off, you bear with us. Get this pulled off. And then we'll uh, have a better look. And here we have the chimney. Dome chimney. Yep. Basically that's shaped, nicely domed at the top. There's no like sharpness or anything like that. It's nice and smooth inside there. Sorry for the dirt. Like I said, I've been using it, so... 
You see that? That's your chimney. And your deck looks like that. Now that is huge. I've got a couple of coils already in here. Um, they're just a 3mm wrap, a dual wrap, NI80 and I think it's Campbell. Um, like I see you do have, you bear with me here, your four post system, which is here, 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 and here. Flat head screws, which are quite good because they're actually sunk in. So basically, your screwdriver doesn't slip out. The holes are three milli here. You've got your three milli holes, so plenty of room for your big builds. Your airflow, it's slightly angled in here. And it angles in just slightly, if you can see there. And it goes up. And it goes under, if you can see, under... Yeah, focus in the dab. See here, you've got a big air hole under there, underneath the coil, and you've got these ones here. So the way I think it works is it all comes in, and if you see it all comes in at an angle. You can imagine that air hole there has come up at that kind of angle, and you've got this one here coming up at that angle. So I'm presuming the air will come underneath the coil and over the top of the coil, take like a half wrap round. Do have your serial number in the deck there. Mine is one three nine. Is that one three nine six? You can see that huge, huge. So I see a separate post. Insulators there, so you've got positive, negative, positive, negative. This deep well, this deep well, this juice well is absolutely huge. I mean, it is. It's twelve milli deep. It's massive. The only thing I've found with it so far are these o rings. As you can see, I don't know if this will focus right in, but you can see that chew to hell. And it came like that. that I think the tolerances on these o rings are really poor, and the quality on them is really poor. They're just ripping to hell. I mean, you can lube them up, but you know, some guys have said they're okay, but the majority of the ones I've seen so far have been chewed up like this. Um, but these do come in two colours up to now. This is the obviously the gold one, and you get the black one. But if you get the black one, it's got a silver deck in. While this is all gold, so you can see. I think we'll uh, we'll get this guy wicked back up, gone up top, and have a toot. Yeah, see you in a bit. Right, people, we get back up top. The Valhalla, all wicked up and ready to go. Now this is going to be scary. <laughs> I forgot to mention before with the coils I've got on, they are coming out at 0.3, 3 or 0.35 ohms, somewhere along the lines of that. But uh, we'll give it a toot, eh? Ooh. As you're sitting on the hammer of God, that's where it was made for to sit on this. You know, there's probably not very many other Addies out there. I mean, probably would sit on, uh, sorry, Addies mod, sorry, bloody hell, blue mod, hell of you. But anyway, not enough coffee, I don't think. But anyway, this build is for a series, para series build, you know, so, you know, I think this is what it's aiming for, the para series stuff. Um, and it just works really well on this Hulk Ford. It, I mean, like I say, it's coming up 0 0.35, 0 0.3, 0 0.35 ohms, and it's oh, it's just delicious. It hits hard, and the flavour, honestly, for, for for a tank this size, the flavour is really good. I mean, I've got the air holes. I haven't got full air because it, it is. It's a very very airy. It's pretty, well, there is some restriction, but I still think it's airy. But there is still some restriction for compared to some other ones where you whack at home and it's like breathing on an aqua lung, you know what I mean? And I think that's down to these honeycomb air intakes here. Um, obviously, where it slopes up and you've got, you know, it goes with an angle under the coil and then goes over the coil. Um, and I think the airflow is a, is a big, big, big hit with this, like, um, because for a big 30 milli atty, well, 30 milli plus atty, because obviously it's a 38, 
the flavour is quite good. It's not mind blown, you know. It's not like your proper little dripper or do you, you know, blow your head, you know. But it's it's good. It's decent. Um, I would probably as a rough guy compare it with the the Titan tank. You know, a big tank, chucks clouds, but the flavour is decent. It's not just like I say. It's not just a cloud chucker. It has got decent flavour. Um, and by yeah, it's really really good. What do I like and what do I not like about it? Well, the legs are pretty obvious. You know, it sits, you know, it sits just lovely there. That, that gold matches the the button on the hog, you know. It was probably, it was definitely made to go on this, you know. It's, it's, it's Vapor's Cloud, you know. It's Vapor's Cloud, mod Vapor's Cloud. Addy, so it was made to go with this at the end of the day. Um, but yeah, the flavour of it's absolutely fantastic for a tank this big and natty this size, you know what I mean? It's really nice. And it's for cloud truck, I mean, Christ, you, you're literally choking on all the all the, all the vapour it produces, you know? It's, this is just like, you know, 0.3 ohm. I mean, imagine, you know, a nice bigger one, you know. I think I said, I think I said my password. You don't want to be put no builds on this. You're just, you're just going to kill the modern yourself. So don't be fucking stupid on that one. Just forget it. 0.3 minimum. And away you can. Lovely safe vape and it hits hard. It's not a pansy, it hits hard. <sighs> Fucking fabulous, man. What I'm not like about this O rings are absolutely horrible. A tear in the bits, even lube the tear in the tolerance. I mean, it's it's really tight. You know, I mean, that just chewed the hell the O rings. You know, I mean, I think better O ring because like the black rubber. I think better O rings. You know, there's little bits of it coming off. I think better O rings would have been an absolute must on it. I mean, I mean it does get up and do, but you know, if they chew, but if they chewed up, you know, they're gonna break the actual seal and it, it may leak out the bottom. But you know, I've, I've had no leaking issues yet with it. I mean, I must give it that it hasn't leaked, but. They have O-rings, they're awful. Um, really need, I don't know if you can get, like I said, this has been out a while now, so I don't know if you know they've corrected that or there's some aftermarket O-rings going for it, you know what I mean? So, definitely the O-rings. Um, when they're like, well, you're stuck with these drip tips, unfortunately. The proprietary drip tips for this thing, you see the bar's huge on it. Um, what I would like to see was maybe it's an 8, is it 810 or 510? 510, 810, I'm lost. Well, whatever, an adapter for it. I mean, put your own on and away you go. 510, I believe it is, yeah, 510 drip tips. <laughs> See, I've got it today, I haven't had enough coffee. But yeah, an adapter, put your own drip tip on. Um, obviously, like, it could be too airy for some people, but yeah, but that's the only thing that I don't really like about them, really. I mean, the deck, it's easy to build on. Flat edge screws that actually sunk into the post so your screw head doesn't shoot off. Um, wicking, you just, you know, just chuck it in, there's loads of it. As long as you like, get, take any other one, as long as you get it, touch the bottom. I tend to have it like, I'll show you, I've got it either side there. I've left like, you can see, I've left a bit in the middle there for the air. I'll just leave that clear. And then when you drip on it, I mean, Christ, I mean, today I'm using this, uh, what have I got the day? I've got this vanilla one out. I think I had this one out the last time. But, you know, you can just absolutely chuck it on, you know. It's got a 12 milli deep juice well. You know, you're not, <laughs> you're probably not gonna get a bloody bottle in it, you know what I mean? It's it's huge, everything about it's huge. And for a huge Addy, the, honestly, it's the flavor's fantastic. Now, buying it, would you buy it? Well. Yeah, I mean, if, if, if you've got this, it's, you know, it's, it pairs up with this, you know, so, you know, if you hit your mix and, you know, you've got this kind of gear, the hogs and what have you, definitely get it, you know what I mean? Um, for what it is, it's really good. It's it's good on flavour. It's not mind-blown, it's not woohoo, but it, it's decent. And you get the clouds, so you get the best of both worlds, right? you know what I mean? So, um, yeah, definitely, it's a definitely a, a one, I think. 
it's going for about 70 quid 70 quid for this that's UK um, I think it's going for about 85 85 80 85 dollars in America um, somewhere along them lines um, but yeah good RDA or a series mod like the hammer of God it was made for it so yeah it's another two that I like Actually trying to like get some air in your nose because that would vapor coming out. It's mad. But yeah, definitely a niche. Same with the hammer of gods. You know, it's a niche thing. That's, that's just the kind that rocks your boat and what you're into. Definitely get it. And especially if you've got one of these. You know, I believe actually. I don't know if they're doing it now. I think something. I don't know if you can get these actually as a kit now. I'm not sure. Um, don't quote us on it, like, but normally if somebody buys that, they'll buy that to go with it, either be it or either or. They'll, they'll, they'll get one or the other to go with it. So, with that one, with that said, like, you know, for a big, big heart here, what can I say? Worth every penny in my eyes. So, with that, before I start gushing on and uh, literally having an orgasm out of this thing, you know, and all this bloody dart, I'll. Uh, I better wrap this one up so I've been the vape and heat. Stay safe, vape safe, and I'll see you next time. Cheers. Bye.